The experiments you will see have been carefully done by professionals and should not be tried at home without parental guidance. Please follow the caution signs throughout this program. Creation is science, where we learn about our creator and discover new ways to find fun in science. I'm Aunt Francine, and this is Professor Roy. Hi. Thank you for joining us, and I think you've got some fun things, but beforehand, let me introduce you to Amanda. Okay, hi Amanda. Aiden. Hi. Aiden, hi. Ishmael. Hi. Ishmael, hi. And Dia. Dia. Hi. hi, good to see everyone. Hey, it's fun. you guys, have you ever thrown a Frisbee? Yeah. yeah. Well, you know, we're going to be studying about some things that is related to a Frisbee. So uh, you got a Frisbee in front of you, right? Yep. Because I'll grab a hold of that Frisbee, okay? Now, what I want you to do is I want you to take both hands, okay? We usually don't throw Frisbees with two hands, okay? But I want you to, here, let me show you. Here we go. Let me show you. So I want you to take two hands like this. Then I want you to just throw that Frisbee just like this to me, okay? And I'm going to be over here. Here, I'm gonna be right here. Uh -oh. And can you can you throw that Frisbee to me? Go ahead, throw it right now. Okay, whoop, there's one. There's two, <laughs> okay. And there's one, there, well, there's three. And there's four. <laughs> Did they come right to me? No. no. Well, you know, it was a little bit difficult, wasn't it? Throwing a Frisbee that way. So what I want you to do this time is I want you to throw the Frisbee like you usually throw it, like with one like hand. This. Okay, so oh. let's try it. Are you ready? Okay. All right, so let's, wait, wait, hang on. But not at the same time, I don't know. Okay, <laughs> all right, go ahead. I'm gonna try to catch it. Throw it, there we go, there's one. Okay, and there's, whoa, two over there. And oh, well, there's three, I caught that one. And whoa, whoa. And that one over there. Oh, that one now, now, let me, now let me ask you a question. Now, when you threw the Frisbee this time, what was different? You're only using one hand. You threw it with one hand, and what else was different? It what went did... smoother and fat and farther. Went smoother? Yeah, and mine faster? hit it. The... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Was there resistance from your other hand? What's that? Was there resistance from your other hand when we threw it with two? You didn't throw it as much force. Yeah. But did you notice that the first time you threw it, it the frisbee did not do what? Sir, uh, spin. Oh. Did not spin. Did not oh. spin. So we're talking about spinning forces today, okay? Spinning forces. Now, you know, I've got a little toy right here. Does anybody know what toy this is? What do we call uh, this toy? Hmm. What do we call it? Heard of it, but I- You've heard of it? Anybody know? No, <laughs> okay. You guys need to be looking at science catalogs more. <laughs> but it's actually a what? It's a gyroscope. A gyroscope spins, okay, just like your Frisbee. When you throw it regularly, the Frisbee spin. So what I'm gonna do is this string is wrapped around the shaft of this, and I'm gonna pull that, and it, this thing's gonna spin really, really fast. And we'll do a little trick with it. I'm gonna set it like here. I'm gonna put it right on there like this. Let's see, what we, look oh, at that, look at that. That and is it's so cool. spinning around, but it's cool. very, very stable and it will fall off when it slows down. Now that's interesting. Isn't wow. It? So just watch that, but we're gonna do a couple of other things over here. So let's see what we got over here. That's First really of all, cool. let's move this Frisbee over here like this. You know, I've got a wheel. Here's a wheel, and this wheel reminds me of that gyroscope. The gyroscope has a wheel, doesn't it? It's spinning fast. Yeah. Yeah, it's really spinning fast. Amanda, can come, you help me? Come on up. Oh, come on over here. Could you stand right over here for me in the center over here? What I want you to do is I want you to hang on to this rope for me like that. All right. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to hook up the wheel with that rope just like that, but hold it up so it doesn't bang on the floor. Now, what would, what do you think would happen? Can you see? Can you see? Do you? Here we go. Now, what would happen if I let my hand go? It tip. It tip. A man is going to fall down if I let my hand go? No, the um, wheel. Oh, the wheel's going to, okay, you don't fall down. down. Okay, all right, let's try it. Are we ready? Uh, a little countdown, here we go. Three, Three two, two, one, I'll let one. my hand go. And the wheel fell exactly down. Like That's exactly what did. happened. Whoa. Now, as long as Amanda has the rope, okay, and holding the rope, hold it up, hold it up, hold it up. Okay, as long as she's holding it here and I have my hand right there, we have a balanced force, don't we? When I move my hand, do we have a balanced force? No. no. Not at all. Hey, would you like to, why did the wheel fall down? Who knows? 
Yes. Gravity. Gravity yes. pulls us down. The other day, somebody said, it's gravity. It grabs gravity. me and it pulls me down. <laughs> well, that's kind of an interesting way of looking at gravity. Now, where does gravity pull us to? The ground. But the ground, what part of the ground? Uh, what part? The, what part of the earth? Below us. The center. The very the center area. of the earth. That's exactly right, Dia. So you know what? We could play a trick on gravity. You want, me, you want to help me play a trick on gravity today? Sure. Ooh, that sounds okay, fun. so what we're going to do is we're going to spin it, the wheel, just like we spun the what? Gyroscope. Gyroscope. Yeah. That's it. So I'm going to spin it really, really fast. Here we go. There you go. Oh, and then go, I'm going to let go, 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 go and you're going to hang go. on to your wheel. Are you ready? Okay. okay. How about a countdown? Three, Three two, 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 one. one. Hang on. Hold it up. Hold it up because it's really heavy. Hold it up. Is the, is the wheel falling down? No. <laughs> the wheel's not keep falling up, down. Up, We're playing up. a trick. We actually Ooh. played a trick on gravity. Isn't that cool? Wow, that is like gravity. What direction is that turning? You're defying gravity. It's going in that direction right here. Let's see if we can reverse the direction by hooking the rope up on the other peg. Are you ready? It's really heavy. I'm going to let it go. Hold it up, and I'm going to let it go. Hold it up, hold it up. And it's turning the other direction. Now, how cool is That's that? That's very cool. You know, gyroscopes are very, very useful. Thank you for helping me with that. Amanda, thank you very much. That's so cool. But you know, gyroscopes are very, 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 very handy because oh. you know what? We have gyroscopes that are in airplanes. Did you know that? That's right. Yeah, I Most think. airplanes have gyroscopes inside of them. In fact, I have a gyroscope that came out of a military aircraft. Now, take a look at this. We can pass this around. And inside of there, there are little tiny wheels, a lot of them, and they're spinning, yeah, and they use air pressure to spin them with. And the pilot can look at that. They can look at that screen on top of there in the front of that. They can tell what the airplane's doing. Okay, the, this, the pilots want to know what the airplane's like doing. Like this. Yeah, by looking at that screen, they can tell what the airplane is doing and they can operate and fly an airplane just on instruments. That's really cool, isn't it? I think so. Hey, let's see what else we got over here. Let's check this out. Now, Dia, can you help me with this? Let's see what we got. We've got a spinning turntable right here. And could you stand on there without falling off? <laughs> okay, there you go. Do you feel comfortable? Uh, kind of. Yeah, well, you're not supposed to feel <laughs> comfortable. Now, what I'm going to do, Dia, is I'm going to... Where are you going? Where are you going? <laughs> okay, move back a little. Here, here, can you, can you spin around? Can you grab some air and spin yourself around? Uh, yes. Keep going, keep going. All the way around, keep going. Oh, okay, now stop going. right there. Now, here, what I want you uh. to do... Here, can you grab a hold of these pegs right here with both hands? Okay, can you put your hands the other way? Can you re reverse them? Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to spin the wheel, but not at the moment. And what I want you to do after the wheel is spinning, then I want you to turn it like this. You got it? Oh, and then turn it back I'm like this. Gonna then we're going to turn it back the other way, just like that. Okay? okay? But you can't let the wheel touch your body because it's not a vegetarian. Okay? It'll just eat your clothes right up. Okay, now let go. What I'm going to do is I'm going to spin it. Remember the gyroscope? Jars and the Frisbee, it had to do what? Spin. It had to spin. That's exactly right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to spin this wheel. I'm going to hand it to you, okay? And then we're going to see what happens to Dia when she does that. That's going to go really fast. Okay, are you ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, grab a hold both pegs. Okay, here we go. All right, there you go. Now turn it one direction. What, what's happening Ooh. to her? She's twin spinning. Whoa, turn it back the other way. Not very. And she goes back. She can go any direction she wants to. Isn't that cool? And so the gyroscope is doing what? It's turning her. She's trying to turn the gyroscope, but the gyroscope is fighting back and it's pushing her in the opposite direction. That is so cool. Hey, you did a great job. Thank Thanks for helping job. me with that. And you, can, why, and you can come up right here. Now, this is interesting. Now, do you get, uh, do you get sick when you spin around? Yes. No, not really. Oh, you not don't? Really. Okay, well, come on over here. Let's see what we got for you. Now, stand, can you stand on the turntable yeah. without falling off? Mm -hmm. Whoa, whoa, where are you going? <laughs> where is he going? All right, you're making me dizzy, stop. Now, what I want you to do is this. I want you to take your arms and put them out like this, okay? And I'm gonna start to spin you around slowly. And then when I say in, when I say in, I want you to take your arms and I want you to put your arms like this across your chest. Oh, I know what's oh, gonna happen. You know what's gonna happen? Okay, are you ready? Yep. Okay, so I'm gonna spin you slowly. Make sure you have balance. <laughs> spin you very slowly. There you go. And let's try it now and in. But whoa, whoa, oh. what happened to Ishmael's speed when he put his arms It in? went faster. He went faster. You know, there was a tremendous amount of energy 
rotational energy when his arms were out. And when he put his arms in, he went faster because that energy had to go someplace. Where did all that energy go? It went into what? The, um, the um, turntable. Thing. It went into speed, right? It went into speed and it went faster and faster. Interesting. Wow, that's interesting. You want to try that? Sure. Okay, well, come on over here. Sounds great. Cool. Well, you're next. Don't, don't go away. <laughs> okay, now hop on there. That's right. You got it. Okay, are you comfortable? Uh, yes. You're not supposed to be. <laughs> okay, put your arms out. Okay, put your arms out. What I'm going to do is I'm going to spin you around, Amanda, okay? Really slow. And remember when I say in, Keep you're going out. to Keep cross out. your arms over your chest. Are you Keep ready? Yes. And in, real fast. Whoa, what happened to her? Did she go faster? Yeah. yeah. She went faster. Well, give it a try. Here we go. Give it a try. Good job. All right. Okay, try to stabilize yourself. Okay. Arms out. Oh, okay. You know the plan, Look right? Look at this. Look at okay, this. We're going to spin ready. you around. Okay. And in real quick. Well, when he goes faster balance. and faster and faster. Good, good job. How about that? I did it the longest. You did a good job too, didn't you? Wow. Did everybody get a chance to try it? Oh, why? Oh, yes, oh, it's crazy. Crazy. Try it. Do you get do you get sick when you spin no. around? I don't know. We'll find out. You you'll oh, find out. I think I think we'll all find okay. out. Okay. <laughs> okay, where are you going? Oh, I don't know where I'm going. Okay, all right. Okay, all right. There you go. All right. Okay, arms out. We're going to mm -hmm. spin you very slowly. Oh boy. Okay, there you go. Oh, very slowly. Boy. Very slowly. And then we're going to go in real quick. And she went oh, faster woo. and faster and faster. All That's, right. Oh, good job. How about that? Oh, that, that was, was actually fun. pretty fun. That's interesting. <laughs> and you know what? You know, besides airplanes having gyroscopes in them, we actually have gyroscopes on satellites. We've got a lot of satellites that are going around planet Earth right now, and they all have, what, gyroscopes inside of them. Isn't that cool? Yeah. So a gyroscope's gyroscope keeps things very, very stable. And without a gyroscope, we would have a hard time flying an airplane. We'd have a hard time f uh, flying a Frisbee if we didn't spin it because the spinning Frisbee was just like the what? The wheel on our little gyroscope spinning very, very fast. How about that? That is interesting. And how the Earth is even spinning a little bit. Oh, absolutely. The Earth is spinning really, the really planet. fast. Yeah, Rotate so around Earth the is sun. In, you think the Earth is in a balance? That's right. You know what? I know that God wants us to be very in balance too, because if we do too much of one thing, what happens? Is our body yeah. out of balance? You're right. So let's let's look up Ecclesiastes. Can you find the Bible, please, Aiden? Ecclesiastes three, verse one. And you know, we can't change situations in our daily life, but there's certain things in a balance. For example, we want to eat a balanced diet, right? Yes. And what if I only did schoolwork all day long? What would happen? Ooh. Uh, that, if you only did schoolwork and well, no play, what would happen? You'd get smart but tired. And your body <laughs> wouldn't do well. You know, it's even important to have some break you time. Did you know that it's good to even have time to play? Play time? That's, everything has to have its balance. And if we don't have that, we're in trouble. Let's read Ecclesiastes 3 verse 1. To everything there is a season, a time for every purpose under heaven. So we need to know whose purpose. Whose purpose do we need to have? Um, God's. God. God's purpose. And how do we know what God's purpose is going to be? By um, reading in the Bible and praying. You're right. And having balance in our lives. And the more we spend time with God, the more we understand what His will for us is going to be, right? And the more we can have that balance in our lives. So let's think about some things. We, we talked about some other things that we can do, but what's something that you might be willing to confess that we need balance in? Hmm. For me, sometimes it's what I eat and put in my mouth. Sometimes yeah. it's just having time for Jesus, right? Thank you for joining us on Creation is Science! Science!